big brother! Little brother! You like! Yeah! It's atmosphere. Leave that one for. Nope. Is there gonna be another health up? Nope. Don't question him. <laughs> <laughs> This silly thing. So good. Just like his, look at his googly eyes. It looks like a lobster. It looks like or it looks like a goofy crab. A goofy crab. Without the claws, crabs are pretty goofy. Okay, I remember how I beat him last time. Pretty sure it's not how you're supposed to do it, but Well, you're not supposed to get hit. For a while. Oh, shoot! I almost forgot to, uh, yeah, well. chug an E-Tank. <laughs> Mega Man! Mega Man, I'm legitimately worried. I think you have an addiction here. Addiction to winning?! That's no problem! Yeah, kicked your ass. <laughs> Did I just walk backwards? It's great. Yeah. Come here, you- Damn it. Oh. You were totally taken in by this last time. You thought I'd beaten the game. Yeah, I was like, wait a minute, what? <laughs> the game actually... See, anybody who's who's played a bunch of Mega Man knows that that's always the fake. Like, they, they've once. seen that trick, like, three or four times. So, only once. This, this might have been the first... No. Did Mega no. Man 2 have a spring head, too? I forget. I, I, I don't know. Because I remember he had to chase Wily, but I forget if he just escaped or not. I'm I'm forgetting. Okay, let's get an extra life. This? Nah. I'll leave these in case I need them. The knuckles all that you heard of. No. Oh right, I forgot. There's another thing. There's but yeah, no. Less. No, I'm using the hard knuckle. Oh, I didn't see you had any last. Yeah. Ow. I love how you just stay on the brush, though. That is why I tried this infinitely better than, uh, coil. Yeah. So, why does he get less effective when you're up here? Uh, because he's dumb? I don't know. He, the, I'm, I'm out of range of his... He was only in Gamma. Alright. Now, this is actually the one thing I remembered. Like, when, on my original playthrough, was that the top spin and the cert snake were good, but I didn't realize it was that good. You top spin. You top spin once, you get hit, but you stay in the air when you're hit, so you just top spin again as you're falling, and you kill him. It's, it was so I, much easier. I don't think you took, like, two bits of the top spin. Yeah, like, the, the first time I did this, uh, it was... So, Wily died. Oh, yeah, totally. Yes. That's the, all the other sequels, no Wileys. I mean, Wily Wars for the Genesis. That that was that was like a prequel. That, no, no, that was like people fighting in, in the name of Wily. <laughs> Here when I arrived, I wonder who brought you here. This whistle. It must have been Pluto Man. <laughs> in case you're wondering why this guy sounds like Elmer Fudd slash Homestar Runner, first of all, because I'm bad at voices. Secondly, it's because Dr. Light sounds like Elmer Fudd in Mega Man 8, if you've never heard it. It's so And good. the only game with voice acting, I believe. Uh, might be the only, yeah, Mega Man classic game. Yeah. I mean, I think there might have been, like, a I... CD one in Japan only, but I'm not counting any of those. Yeah, there might have also been uh, some voice acting in Mega Man Soccer. I, I don't think no, there was. I, I'm pretty sure that it but uh, see, it's listing all the all the robots from Mega Man One. We got Roll, housekeeping robot, former assistant, <laughs> now badass. Oh, but what's this? Number Zero, Proto Man, brother of Mega Man. That's all. That's all his character. 
For the longest time, I called him Scarf Man. By the way, look, it's Beat up there. That's the tree. No. That's that's the that's the sequel hook. You're like, oh, what's that character? That's Zilla. not just any bird. Zilla, though. Friggin... That's Scarf Man, not Proto Man, not Break Man. Scarf Man. That's how I define him. Yeah. I mean, he doesn't have that cool scarf. Yeah, scarf and shades, and that's all, I mean, you know. That kind of reminds me that, uh, the Proto Man's redesign in the Battle Network series, it bothered me because it was closer to, like, a Zero design than a Proto Man design. Yeah, it's like they wanted to put Zero in there, but they did put Zero in there. But later, and they, like, pried off his Robo Nipples. No <laughs> idea how weird that was. I mean... Oh man, it's like deja vu. I wonder yeah, why. Yeah. Alright, yeah. it's because somebody didn't start the recording last time. Mm, yeah, blame the cat. <laughs> yeah, blame, blame the cat. Totally the cat's fault. <laughs> Just gonna double check. Yeah, we're good. <laughs> <laughs> He's like... Like, the cat's just like, what are you talking about? I'm like, not even near you guys. <laughs> so the top spin ended up being the hero in all this. The best weapon to the final boss. So I guess there's a moral to this story. Don't judge a book by its cover, or its first impressions. Or judge it by how much damage it does in the final boss. Yes.